Hey, what's up, guys? Um, in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to make a free capture page. So, let's jump right into it. Um, now, to create websites or pages, um, what I like to use is Wix. So, if you don't have an account, just sign up and register. It's free. And then, um, click right here. Let's make a new site. And then I'm just going to pick business. It doesn't really matter. And then we'll do uh, the Wix editor. And I'm going to just do a blank template. That's, I mean, you could pick a pre made one and edit it, but I just have to start from scratch. So we'll do that. So first thing, we'll just add a background. Um, they have pre-selected images, or you could just uh, upload your own. But uh, for this video, we'll just make it quick for demonstration. And I'll pick this one. All right. And um, I'm going to change this color. So we'll go ahead and do design. Let's make it black. And I want to make it, I don't want it to be so solid, so let's see if we could change the opacity to 75. There, that looks a little more classy. Alright. Let's go ahead and add some text in there. Yeah, but I might be going through this kind of fast for you, so I mean, you know, if you have to just watch it again, uh, feel free to do that. But yeah, as long as you can see what I'm doing, that's the main thing. Now let's go ahead and edit this. Well, yeah, let's edit. Uh, let's make this text bigger. Just like that. And let's change the color right here. Let's make it bold. And another thing I like to do that makes it look a lot more catchy is add a shadow. Just makes the text look a lot more better, more professional. One more thing, let's go ahead and center it too. Alright. Now let's go ahead and change it. I was going to mix uh, something real quick, but you'll get the idea. Go. that looks a little bit better so there's the text and um, okay so from here this is all pretty much set up now you just got to add a web form so we'll go ahead and do that oh yeah by the way this is get response this is my email marketing um, platform and uh, this is also what I use for autoresponders, but no, we'll get into autoresponders in another video. You know what, this one looks pretty good. Yeah, sorry if I'm going kind of fast, but yeah, so uh, when you get to forms, create a form, list builder, and then all of these pre-made templates will pop up. Take a little time to load, so just give it a second. Let's go back up. I've seen a good one up here. Or was it? I think it might be more down, actually. Let's see. This one right here. This one looks pretty good.
let's go ahead and change this. Make the font bigger right here. That works. We'll delete this because I mean you can. This is up to you if you want to leave it or not. But I mean, I feel like you get a higher opt-in rate without it. So I'll take it off. Move this up. And bring this over with me. This one too. And let's go ahead and make this smaller. Just click outside of the box and then click on it again. Right down here, drag it up. And that's it. Let's go ahead and save and publish that. Now for Wix, they don't, you can't use JavaScript with Wix, so you have to go down here and copy this web address. Then you go back to the Wix editor and add all the way to the bottom, click on more, and click on HTML code. Then you want to go to settings, website, address, and then paste that address right there. Then you have to update. Then you're going to have to open up this box to reveal it. Center it. Let's see how that works. Let's take a little, little bit off. There. All right, that looks good. So, and that's pretty much it. I mean, this is all you need to have a capture page set up. So, whenever someone punches in their information. It's going to get saved into my email marketing system, into my contacts. Yep, right into there. This is my main campaign. The campaign is basically just a, just like a, a specific category that you want certain contacts to be saved into. So, another thing, important thing that you're going to have to do for this to work is uh, you're going to have to go to your campaign settings right here. You're going to have to go to permissions and you're going to have to make sure these are all unchecked because if you don't, they're going to be required to do a double opt-in which is going to basically just make it harder for you to get subscribers because what that is is say like they punch in their email um, what's gonna happen is they're gonna receive that email and then they're gonna have to click on it and then they're gonna have to subscribe from there so it's just a lot more of a hassle to get a subscriber which it just it just makes it harder to get subscribers in general so with these unchecked uh, right when they punch in their email it's gonna get it's gonna get saved automatically you don't have to worry about them going in, digging in their email, finding the message, and subscribing or whatever, so this is going to make it a lot easier to get subscribers right here by having these all unchecked. And, yeah, that's about it. I mean, it, it, there's people too that like to add videos or images, so I mean, if you wanted to add a video to your capture page, you just go right here, and then right there where it says video, just click on that YouTube box. And then, uh, let's see, so we'll have to move this out of the way. Let's drag it down. Let's drag this down, drag it down a little more. That should be good. Now, for your video, you want to make it bigger right here. Drag this down more. That should fit. Just want to make sure everything's separated and centered. Make sure this one's centered too. Just move it. Right there when you see that purple line that means it's centered. Now you got a video on your capture page. 
See, now it's going to look a little bit bigger, but this is this is pretty optimized for mobile. So that's the one thing about Wix is they're, they have this option right here where you can make it mobile friendly, but it's it sucks. It doesn't work that good. So I like to just turn it off. And then um, so when someone actually checks it out, it'll look just like this. It, you know, you won't have nothing missing. And then um, it'll actually look really good. It's basically optimized for mobile viewing. So uh, this is how you would want to have it set up. So yeah, um, add videos. You can make this image if you want. You know, it's, it's pretty customizable. So and it's pretty simple too. So I guess that's it for this video. Uh, hope it helps.